What is up guys, EJ here, back with another video, and today is the very first day of the SHTF Mystery Survival Box unboxing video. And uh, sorry this just took a little bit for this to be put up. I kept forgetting uh, to do a video, so I'm starting to do the video now. So prior to recording this video, I did open the box already to kind of see what was in the box. And I used a um, app on my phone to kind of read what the products were and at least try to give you the best description that I possibly can in this video. So without further ado, let's open this box and see what we got. So starting off, just picking out of the box, we're going to go with Matches. Um, I don't know if you guys can see what the name brand or if there is a name brand on them. But to get four packs of matches, four boxes of matches in this uh, Ziploc bag, which is pretty cool. I don't know if I ever use them, but you never know. Never say never. You may need a light of candle um, or, or a lantern or something like that. So you never know. You might need these. All right. Next. This is from what I saw in the description. Um, on the box that it could read, it's a three-in-one auto toolbox, and I only was seen only like really two features on this thing: um, the light that's right here, which I'll turn the light on, and you have on the side here is like um, like oh my, like one of those collapsible fishing poles. You turn this. And I guess it generates the power to the light there. So that's pretty cool. And then down here at the bottom, you have a J knife, which I, I figured that one out pretty quick. But I don't know what this is. So if anybody's gotten uh, this mystery box with this in it, let me know in the comments down below. It, it, I don't know. I don't know if it, if it controls the... Um, field of view for the light or if it's just a hammer or a pointed hammer. I don't know what this is. It looks like it would be something like a hammer that you can, but I don't know. But leave it in the comments and let me know about it. All right, our next thing is, this is a headlamp, which is pretty, pretty cool. Um, I've been kind of wanting one of these for a while, even though the fact, yes, I can't see, but if I'm walking somewhere at nighttime and I need people to see me, then I can use this headlamp, which is totally cool. You got a button right up here. I think you'll have like strobe, SOS, and probably uh, flat, uh, flat light, which is basically just one solid light. Adjustable in the back. And it also takes AAA batteries, three AAAs. So I'm gonna get some AAAs and check this thing out very, very soon. Next, if I can get to it, there we go, is some wire. Um, it didn't come in a package, it just gave me some wire which is a lot of wires, very uh, very stretchy, um, bendable. So if you need to wrap up something, um, a hammock or whatever, or something, I don't know what you can use it for, but that's what I got in the box. Now this here is really cool. Um, I'll try to show you guys the box there. Uh, the best I can. It might be upside down, so I'll turn it this way. This is a Shadow Warrior pocket knife. This is really, really, really nice. I like it a lot because it's got so many cool little designs and carvings and stuff in it. It's really neat. I've used it a couple times just, just to kind of see how sharp it is, and this is right out of the box. is very sharp. So I like it. And then on the back here, you have this little pull thing here. I guess you can pull it down and 
and it is on spring loaded, so be very careful. The blade itself has got like some really cool carvings in it and all that cool stuff like that. I really don't want to use it, but it's a really nice, very sharp knife. Very easy to handle, feels great in hand, and I mean, it's just an amazing looking knife. And then there's a locking pin right there. You just pull that back with your finger, and as you can see, there we go. Really, really nice knife. Now, last but not least, and I want to tell you guys this before I pull this out of this box. This is unreal. I didn't expect really to get this uh, in a mystery box, you know, first on. I thought maybe this will come later, but, well, CH Kettles, you can never say never. You can never guess what they'll give you until you get it. So, this is a black and yellow machete, but it's just, well, as you can see, the yellow sheath, black handle. But this ain't just some normal machete. This is a sawback machete. I have never seen a sawback machete before ever in my life. <laughs> this, <laughs> this is unreal. Um, the blade is not really sharp yet. I haven't sharpened it. I do have a sharpener for it, but I just haven't really gotten up to really sharpen it quite yet but the saw on this side here is extremely sharp ready to go right out of the box which is pretty cool so you can hold it like this or you can hold it like this and you're gonna be fully protected where your hands not gonna slip and hit the, the teeth here on the saw or your hands gonna run across the machete blade which is really I like the design of it. It's actually kind of cool. But um, I will do a video one day, probably during the summer when there's a lot of branches I want to cut down. I'm going to try this saw back, saw back machete out on some of the trees out in front of our house and all and, and kind of see how good it really cuts through things. So, And then there's a little design or emblem right there. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it, but it's a very nice, very stable knife, guys. Solid. It doesn't bend. It doesn't, you know, move around inside the the handle. It's a solid. It looks like it's held together with maybe Allen wrench screws. From what it looks like, so it looks like if the blade is bad, you can always go get it, exchange it out. That's pretty neat. But yeah, guys, this is a really good mystery box right here. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and leave it in the comments if you want to see more videos like this on the channel. Uh, this is something that I wanted to throw into it, kind of mix up the channel a little bit more, add some new stuff in and the SHTF mystery box um, was one of them. So take care guys, as always, stay awesome, and we'll see you soon.